Here, you go low, I go high. Wait, oh, holy shit! Uh oh. We are going to be trying out some wine hacks. Yeah, so we're gonna open a bottle of wine using nothing but fire. We're gonna show you how to remove a red wine stain using only white wine. And then we're gonna turn water into wine. The best one yet. You warm up the neck of the bottle and the cork pops out. This isn't gonna make the wine go everywhere, is it? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> hey Liz, this is how the cavemen used to do it. Me, what wine? We should have marked where it started. It's in the bottle. I this party trick's kind of a buzzkill. Uh, it is. <laughs> oh, Chris, look at. Oh, we're I think burning. we're melting. No, stop. You're melting the cork. Oh my god, we are melting okay. the cork inside. That's part of the process. We're gonna impress so many people at the next party. Hey, you want some hot wine? How do you like your wine? Boiling? Don't you have another bottle we can try? Try this one. Take two. At this point, everyone at the party left. Hey, you go low, I go high. I'm at. Wait! Holy shit! This is. Uh oh. Oh my god. <laughs> I told you I would go up there. So for our next trick. <laughs> Let's make even more of a mess. Yeah, supposedly you can get red wine stains out of your shirt by using white wine. I'm a little tipsy after drinking wine and I get very talky with my hands. You're drinking it and you're- Yeah, oh hey. Oh, oh no. no, oh my gosh, it looks like it slipped my throat. Put a little bit on there. There you go, yeah. Oh, shucks. shucks. <laughs> that stain will come right out with some white wine. Beer bottles are way easier to open. <laughs> you put a little bit of red wine. White wine? You put a little bit of white wine. Did I, you drink it? All I had was one sip. Well, I know, I think if you warm it up, it like makes it oh, like yeah. crystallize. Oh. I think we just made drugs. We made moonshine. Oh my god. That dead. Oh, that didn't work. Do the, the dab and twist method. It's supposed to just suck the red stain right out. No. I feel like this is like the start of an OxyClean commercial. White wine stains, no problem. There you are, Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> Get to the chopper! Watch this lens. And boom! Look, lens, it worked! <laughs> That's crazy! Okay, on to the next one. <laughs> you might want to take notes on this one. This hack is going to turn water to wine. You need a piece of plastic, fill up a glass of water, and a glass of wine. We're going to stay in the counter? Probably. This, this could be bad. Put under paper towel. There you go. Protection. Always good when drinking wine. I'm going to flip over this glass of water. Holy shit, I did it. <laughs> you're leaking. Linz, I know I'm leaking. I'm just, oh. we're leaking a lot. I, well, Linz, I'm trying here. You're not helping. Maybe we just gotta do some like one fluid motion. No. That didn't you're work. Not. Ah, that didn't work. Help, Linz, what are you doing? It did it. Get up there, you bastard. <laughs> now that you flooded your kitchen, you can finally turn water to wine. Pull the plastic over a little bit. Water can unite with the wine and become wine itself. There's a scientific way of putting this, but that's my way. Okay. <gasps> Look, we're making water wine. Yo, this is exactly how Jesus did it. We just made everybody's quarantine that much better. Yep. Real quick. Oh God. <laughs> I like this shirt. Damn it. Now we have two glasses of wine. So cheers. That is how you turn water to wine. Great job, Chris. You're welcome. Let's clean up. <laughs> it smells like the day after a frat party in here. You're not sure. I know you're I have not no sure. idea what we're doing. No. And friends are families.